Woman of Reddit, what job would a man have that would be an automatic deal breaker for you? Truck driver. Worked in the industry and every single one lived a double life. Loving husband and father at home but out with hookers doing coke on the road. After a while some end up with whole ass second families. It changed the way I approach relationships completely. Trust issues is an understatement. Edit this is also the reason women in male dominated fields is so threatening for a lot of men. Law enforcement or military. I dated a former cop and an active e-cop, and the active cop made a few casual comments that were gigantic red flags. The former cop had severe psychological problems absolute lack of understanding of feelings, like Dexter, only he had no effort to figure it out, although I think that predated his time as a cop. I tried to be open-minded but nope, never ever again. This is going to sound weird but veterinarian. I just couldn't be a supportive partner and listen to them vent about the stress of taking care of sick animals and having to put them down as the humane options. I'd never stop crying and I just don't have the emotional strength or stability to be a good partner for them. That or a dentist cause they scare the hell out of me. Lack of a job and zero desire to get one is a deal breaker for me. He could be tin tin smoking hot but if he refuses to work and just sits on his ass all day playing video games and drinking, I'm out. A guy doesn't have to make $60 an hour, but I'm in my 30s. I need someone who has a job and is financially responsible. I'm not looking to be anyone's sugar mama. Military. My dad is military army and he and my mom have a practically non-existent relationship. He left when I was two and I barely know him because of it. Mom and him fight a lot because of it and she has said several times that she regrets marrying him. I don't want that for myself. Sorry military guys. Nothing against you just personal trauma. Why is pimp repeated so many times? Like isn't it obvious enough or is girls falling for pimp some kind of stereotype I'm unaware of? No shit you wouldn't date a pimp? Hmm who else? Don't forget to add child molesters to that list otherwise that means you're open to them to us. Anything where corruption and terrible moral choices are the go-to. Hedge fund manager. Cop. Parking warden. And anyone who kills people whether for a wage or their own personal satisfaction. Recruiters. Telephone salespeople. Insurance. These would all give me pause. Any kind of first responder because I couldn't handle the stress that they might not come home one day. Every day any job that requires constant travel and any job that would require him to relocate I don't mean relocating for a new job. No gun wielding control freaks. The list is long, but law enforcement and infantry are at the top of the list. I also want nothing to do with religious or political zealots. Police. Firefighter. EMT. Doctor. Entrepreneur. Give me a man who has work-life balance and doesn't need to be at work the majority of his day or put themselves in danger. How do people feel about oil and gas workers? I find I get looked down on because of it, to the point where if someone asks me what I do I just say I am a laborer. My ex was a massage therapist at a strip club. Like he gave the strippers massages because their muscles got tired, lol. I wouldn't date another one of those. Ladies, find yourself a truck driver. We make the best partner. You miss us, we come back. We start to annoy you when we are home, we leave again. Lol. To the women commenting in this post, know that it gave me great pleasure to spend the last few minutes upvoting every one of you who said cop. A serial killer, I mean come on. I don't mind making more than my spouse if he's a good and decent man. The gold digger trope has gotten old now. Apparently photographer is because I haven't had a date in two years. But before that when I was at USPS I was getting dates all the time. A choo-choo conductor. Last thing I want to do is see your smug face as you slowly pass the tracks, making me late for work. MLM, whole life insurance sales, selling how to get rich quick packages, and the like that's hustle and scammy. I'm sure there are others, but cop influencer sprung immediately to mind. Absolutely not keep walking. Anything related with sex, drugs, fetishes, etc. Anything along the lines of those and worse of course. Something religious. I'm an atheist, happy to be one, and have no interest in becoming an ex-atheist. Anything that interferes with his ability to contribute equally to domestic labor and childcare. I met a man who makes artisanal flesh lights at a party in LA. Would not date that guy. Not seeing janitor on here. So I'ma tell the next woman I date that's what I do now. Police officer or circus performer. Have dated both. Would never date either again. Cop. Any kind of religious leader, mortgage real estate broker or sales, dentist. Anything to do with pornography director, editor, actor, cameraman, law enforcement. 
the profession seems to attract controlling types, a stripper or adult film movie maker, even an athlete or musician, politician, puppy clubber, professional internet complainer, chef, DJ, sex worker, drug dealer, politician, sleazy sales, army, cop, fed, associated with private prisons in any way, anything involving the military, navy, etc. I'm sorry.